Are you the kind of person that likes having your meat flattened out? Well, if you do, today's your lucky day, because today we're doing smash burgers on the Blackstone. I think I like this little life. This little life. I think I like this little life. So, first thing we have to do is toast off some buns. We don't put butter on these, we use QP mayonnaise. Just adds a little bit more flavour. Quick turn every once in a while just to make sure they're not too toasted. Fry off some onions and a few mushrooms. These will go on the burgers later. The onions have been cooked with um, a little bit of Japanese barbecue sauce. Gives them some colour and flavour. Mushrooms just plain fried with some butter. Hit the grill with a little bit of avocado oil. The grill's nice and hot, around 425 degrees. So these are four ounce balls of 80-20 ground beef. And with the grill at the right temperature, we're getting that sizzle. With a square of parchment paper to stop the meat sticking and a nice heavy weight, you squish those balls down as thin as you can. The idea is to get them nice and thin so we get the crust on both sides and the crispy edges. Once you're done smashing, it's time for a little seasoning. All we're using here is some coarse black pepper and some sea salt. You really don't need anything more complicated than that. Waiting for the first side to cook and you'll see when it's done, when it starts bubbling through to the surface. Once that first side is cooked, it's time to flip the burgers over. If you use a good stiff spatula with a beveled edge, it should be nice and easy to lift them clean from the grill, ready for flipping. Now we're going to take care of the first topping. There's going to be one burger with the mushrooms on. That's for my wife. She likes mushrooms. I hate them. And then the other two are going to get topped with the onions. And that's going to be for me. It's going to be a double stack. That's how I like it. Never forget to bang your tongs on the grill because that just makes you look professional. Finally, we're going to put some sliced cheese on top. Just regular old American sliced cheese works just great and melts really, really well. Now we get the bottom bun ready to receive its little smashed burger of loveliness. It's the single stack with the mushrooms for the wife. And a double stack with the onions for me. As long as I don't drop it. Finally, we load up onto the plate, ready to go. And this is going to be accompanied with a little pasta salad and should be a meal for kings. So, there we go. Smash burgers done on the Blackstone Grill. Give it a try. I'm sure you'll love it. I think I like this little life. This little life.